The following podcast has been rated listener MA. It contains strong language, violence, adult situations, nudity. Listener discretion is advised. Uh, would you rather give up cheese or blowjobs for the rest of your life? Oh, blowjobs all day. I, I'm the same. I'm fucking Yeah, away. they hurt my jaw. Blank. Rejected name for condoms. Gosh, I don't know. Cock koozies, jizz mittens, ham holsters, kidnappers. Yeah, try it now! <laughs> <laughs> try it, try it now! What's up, everybody, and welcome to Laughing on the Sidelines Live! <laughs> Woo! Holy shit, balls! We got a lot of people in here, guys. There is. Yeah, that's who made this table? What the fuck are you looking table? for on that? Huh? Who made this table? You're so far away from it. That's the way it's supposed to fucking <laughs> be. By design. <laughs> We should this. really be in a different room. You should be in a different room and not talking. Don't you have somewhere to be fucking up a video cast or something? Shut up. Video feed? Fuck. Fuck you. They've got a glory hole right. for here for when you oh, get is that for right later. For? Yeah. Oh, so, they darn. I, and I think you're short, so I don't think you're going to hit your head on the top of it. <laughs> so you're in good shape. That's a yeah. half inch hole. That's made for you, Scotty. Yeah. Yeah. Jeremy, you and I might fit in the same hole at the same time. Dude, I would so do that. <laughs> <laughs> He's I really making X. Do, I really do need a fucking booster seat right now. I'm, so I should just stand up or something. Just show them how short you are, you fucking freak. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> Vote change! Yeah. <laughs> Same. Doesn't matter. If anybody wants to come up and feed him applesauce, <laughs> do that fucking airplane thing. Come on, open the hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. I, okay, I heard somebody came all the way from San Diego, California for this. Are you lying? Why? Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Why? You get us on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Le- no. Legitimately, as appreciative as I am, my first thought went to fuck that guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's an asshole with too much money on his fucking hands right there. <laughs> No, guys, we do. We have a great, great episode. It's going to be a little bit different. It's going to have a lot of the same stuff. But if this is the very first time you're watching this show uh, for YouTube, you missed out on a lot of shit. I'm just going to go ahead and say that right now. You're not going to like it. <laughs> you're not going to like it at all. Actually, we're just doing highlights. Oh, yeah. Is yeah. That what we're doing? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Okay. We're, we're going to make this 100% sports highlights, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Roll the clip. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> And we are apologizing ahead of time if, if you are the wife of your husband who actually watches and has to sit through this. I'm talking uh, to you right there. <laughs> he looked right over at her. So sorry. If you've so been sorry. the recipient of any of my advice, I apologize to your spouse. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's no. called bad advice, for fuck's yeah. sake. <laughs> yes. Uh, but it, again, if this is the very first time, this is a comedy podcast where we like to make inappropriate jokes about the current events that are going on in sports and inappropriate jokes that have nothing to do with sports whatsoever. In fact, they're all targeted towards me and I don't care. Uh, this is also a, a, a adult podcast where we like to use foul language and make loud noises. So if that's not your thing in the wrong place, get the fuck out of here. Thank you and bye. Woo! We got a lot of shit. We got a lot of stuff winded. to talk about. You should, you should leave. Uh, what? Yeah. No. This guy can host. No. Yeah. I Who's going to wear the belt, belt, bitch? Let's let the, let's let the Jeremy Joseph t-shirt guy host. Okay. I, I'm we have like that way better. <laughs> yeah. yeah, see? That is a popular <laughs> opinion. Uh, the, the honor of hosting this fucking podcast, no thanks. Um, <laughs> I don't want to be known for that. But this guy here, he's got the right fucking idea. Let's get him and his shirt up here. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, but we uh, we basically are free roaming here. Uh, I uh, I see that we have a Cardinals fan down here. At a boy. Someone wasn't hugged enough as a child. Boy. That's uh... <laughs> uh, anywhere anywhere else. Where did everybody else come from? Anybody come from play- somewhere far? I heard Alabama here. It's not a TikTok live, Scotty. Shut Jesus fuck fucking up. Christ. Arkansas. Arkansas. I came from 
That's yeah. Yeah, we all yeah. did. Yeah. Did you come out of the puss or the ass? I'm just kind of questioning. <laughs> just making sure. Ass. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Either yeah. way, it was deep. <laughs> <laughs> deep south. Yeah. Well, we do have to kind of. Uh, I, I mean, do you want to even do a recap of our week at all, or no? What the fuck for? We were just recorded the last podcast like three days ago. <laughs> uh, what the fuck could have happened? I worked what? and I didn't work. That's, that's it. True. The one thing that I did do is I know this is a special occasion. Yes. And so, uh, Jeremy Joseph, you're one of my favorite people in the world. Of I got course you, I am. I got you a gift. Is that true? That is true, my I friend. I hope it's fucking Uh-oh. Spanglers. There you go, buddy. It is not Spanglers. It is not. <laughs> well, then fuck it. I don't want it. <laughs> Ah, oh, you're going to love it. Am I? Yes. I I have a hard time believing that's true. But I, uh, I, I can't get it. It's a goddamn here. bag, Jeremy, for fuck's sakes. <laughs> what are you doing? Drop my fucking knife all the way over there. It's all over the fucking floor. <laughs> all right. Jesus Christ. I cannot get in here. He double knife. Is this Chinese finger cuts from my wife has something to do with this? <laughs> Fucking Asians. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, shit, you broke it. I sure did. What is this? Uh oh. That, my friend, is an autographed picture of Benny Ogbayani. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! The one and only. In a very <laughs> shitty picture frame, if I may add. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Thank you, dude. <laughs> this, uh. this is going up in place of me and my wife's wedding page. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you I might need a new frame for it, though. No. Uh, <laughs> well, you know, I do woodworking, so uh, <laughs> yeah, I will. <laughs> no way I can make this fucker. Yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Is, is this Paid three thousand dollars for that, Jerry. That seems high <laughs> <laughs> for a guy who had a four-year career and now throws <laughs> luggage at the fucking Hawaii airport. Uh, that really seems high. But uh, <laughs> hey, look, you make your own fucking choices in life, and uh, whatever road you want to go down, right? There you Love go. It. <laughs> Well, uh, this is a sports podcast, which is gonna, it's going to make it time, but uh, so we, I guess we do got to talk a little bit about sporting events, right? Do we? Yeah. We kind of do. All I right. think that's part of the sidelines part of it, I think. Yeah, I think yeah, so. Yeah, I think sure. so. Sure. Uh, and uh, why not get into everybody's favorite subject, Filipino beach volleyball? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Strictly that, Filipino. Yeah. No, uh, so serious question. Who do you got in the World Series? Make it. We're, we're stamping this shit right now. Oh, I don't give a shit. I want the fucking Padres and nobody else. Astros. Yeah, I, Astros I, and the dads. Astros and the dads. Yeah. Me. I hope the Padres actually win by default because a fucking bomb blew up in the fucking <laughs> Astros Yankees game. Yeah, I don't. I don't see how. Like, unless you're from like the Houston area, how you can still be an Astros fan. Right? I was a big fan of Hurricane Harvey. Yeah. <laughs> Love that thing going on. That's a good point. That's a very good point. I'd like damage. I, I, I'm really pissed off it went away. The Harvey and the Oilers. I, I really <laughs> should have never left Houston. You managed that band, didn't you? Harvey and the Oilers? I, Harvey and the Oilers. Yes, yeah. I did. I'll be darned. They were a four part harmonica band. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I heard the Yankees coach like blamed it on the fucking roof being open. That's yeah. why the Yankees lost. Millie it. Vanilli blamed it on the rain. Oh, really? <laughs> Really? I'll be damned. Well, they, they lip sync. Somebody else actually said it. Oh. But then they, they claim to take credit for it. Oh, I got it. I got it. Uh, you heard that too. People right? in this yeah. fucking room don't know what I'm talking about. They're all six <laughs> years old. <laughs> I'm sorry. I should have I referenced something by the fucking Teletubbies. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Millie Vanilli was a band who, got, who won an, uh, what do they call it, Grammy. Yeah, yeah, and then uh, got to take it away because they lip synced a song called Blame It on the Rain. I love comedy. You got to fucking explain to people. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but no, how does that make a fucking difference? If the roof is closed or... It's, if you lip sync? Huh? Are we still on lip syncing? <laughs> no, no. I don't even know what's happening anymore. <laughs> no. I'm going to go home. Jim, <laughs> pay attention. What? Okay. <laughs> Yankee Stadium being open. How in the hell can that... Like, it's it got no roof, Right. How the fuck can that make a difference in the in the Astros game? The Explain. Heat. It's not the heat; it's the humidity. Oh, yeah, that's I think that's what they and, say. And, yeah. and Harvey, 
And Har- yeah. Harvey, yeah. Hurricane Harvey right. definitely. And not Hurricane Harvey. We're talking about Harvey Dent, Two Face. Yeah, Two Face. Yeah, he was. He completely conspired against the fucking Yankees. And Hold up. Are you saying Harvey Dent is Two Face? Well, yeah. Maybe. Fucking spoiler alert, you sons of bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but yeah, uh, so yeah, that's, that's baseball. Um, it sure is. <laughs> yeah, that's baseball. I mean, what are you going to do, right? It's, uh, fuck, that's baseball. Yeah, that's right. Um, but moving on, um, Thursday night football for the very first time was not a fucking dud. There was more than 15 points scored. Yeah, yeah. I Great. think the under, so that's good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> The one time it was great was bad for Derek. Yeah, that's absolutely. Right. But that's even betting, period, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, you've lost to me two years in a row in fantasy football. Actually, that's both nothing of you to fucking do with it, for fuck's yeah. sake. No, I know. I, I don't, don't like know. to think I lost just so much as I didn't win. Uh, with you winning, I like to think America lost. Oh, <laughs> absolutely. Well, I mean, I did bring my best podcast host of all time belt, but... Well, that's not for fantasy football. Oh, fuck me. Yeah. Fucking rub it in, bitches! It's going in the garbage. Keep laughing, assholes. Uh, <laughs> I love it. I think it's great. This of course is, you do. I know. You bought it for yourself, you prick. I bought it for our league. You got that guy face down. Why are you always trying to do that shit, Scotty? I, I'm not doing enough. Your wife it. drives an 82 Pinto because you spent all your fucking life savings on that goddamn belt. This is 100% true. No, uh, I'm, I wanted to make sure I brought it for this special occasion so these guys can see it. You should give it to a fan. <laughs> no shit. No. Yeah, I mean, what do you guys think? Should we give it to a fan? Yeah, you should give it to a fan, Scott. Derek and I will be happy to autograph that if it gets the fuck off the desk. Yeah, I will inscribe his phone number on the back of it. <laughs> no, because this year, it, it's, it's, it's gone. It's going yeah, Do you think he's gonna win three times, Jeremy, or no. one? Oh, well, he's won twice, and I don't care for that. What yeah. are you talking about? Well, on the, the, with, uh, with the inscription. I wasn't paying attention again. With the I, inscription. I, three times or one. I mean, I know you had that gummy bear that was six times hotter. Oh, fuck, it yeah. was. Yeah. Six. Six! <laughs> six goddamn times hotter! You cocksucker! <laughs> you bearded fucking prick! Yeah, that guy right there. <laughs> Seriously, what's it going to take for you to get a fucking razor and go to work on your neck? I, I don't know. Just the neck. Just or the your wrist. Right what, like, what about your wrists? That's why the table's so big, is because you can't smell my wrist from No, me. that's not what I'm talking about. Oh, I'm taking down the driveway, not across the street, Scotty. Let's oh. do this. <laughs> oh, my bad. My bad. But no, your, your wife is probably going to win this, this belt this year. I'm, I'm calling it right now. She's in the audience. I'm calling you out right now. <laughs> and yet she's married to Derek, so she's already lost. That's Absolutely. True. 100%. <laughs> God. Well known yeah, fact. We did have uh, we had some trading rumors that uh, are coming up in the NFL. Yeah, we, rumor has it Christian McCaffrey's going to get traded to the 49ers. He did. Oh, oops. It happened. And well, let's uh, just think of it as a rumor. Yeah. yeah. We'll just rumor it out of here. Yeah. Shh. Yeah, don't say nothing. Um, OBJ, where does he go? Everybody's been saying Chiefs. Minnesota. Minnesota. Anybody else? OBJ sounds like a Christmas carol about blowjobs. It sure does. It does. I'm sure it, he, he's got a song. Is he not with the Giants anymore? No. <laughs> I don't really follow sports. <laughs> That's your job. Now. Well, I follow uh, Taiwanese kickboxing. Oh, okay. <laughs> and and uh, not Thailand, Taiwanese. Oh, got it. It's uh, a lesser version. Uh, but it's lesser than Chinese. Filipino volleyball. You do. <sighs> God damn it. What? Gotta ruin the fucking show, don't you? Every time. That's my job. Why you gotta I'm bring the, the Chinese bag. into this? Why you gotta bring the fucking Chinese into this? I, well, isn't your wife Chinese? Yeah. Right? From Japan, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and uh, and uh, as I've expressed many times, don't care for it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> can, can, I, can I ask you a personal question? Nope. <laughs> Please? I'd prefer you didn't talk. In fact, uh, Levi cut his fucking mic. <laughs> How does she put up with your personality? I have no fucking clue. <laughs> Honestly. It is, it is fucking beyond me. I have found the only woman in the world who is turned on by ethnic slurs. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she's smitten. Smitten with my fucking insults about her oh. all the time. That was either her or She Paula loves Dean. laundry and dishes. She, uh, <laughs> that's what those ladies do, you know. What? Dishes? Dishes, laundry, oh, well, whatever. Yeah. Especially Asians. And wreck your car. It's true. God damn it. Why you got to get fucking stereotypical now? I, 
some of them are fucking right. I mean, yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> yeah, they can't drive. They can't. It's okay. By the way, has anybody ever seen a uh, like a bronze colored or gold colored Honda CRV and a middle aged Asian woman wasn't driving? <laughs> <laughs> I would just like to know if that exists, like on the used market or something, because I don't think it does. No, probably not. Um, but yeah, you got any other sports you want to talk about? Before I didn't want to talk about these. Oh, well, fine. Then we can move on. You want to move on? Fuck yeah. Okay. All right. Keep laughing, assholes. No. <laughs> Quit that. That's not my ready. line. Yeah. That, we're not ready. I'm just trying to make Levi ready over here. He's, okay. He's fucking no. sleeping. He's doing just fine. For God's fine. sake. He's worse than Mitch was. That's true. Uh, Mitch is a piece of shit. He is a he piece sure of shit. He sure was. That guy couldn't look up nothing. Mm -hmm. That's right. Uh, but no, we do have a lot of fun stuff to get to. Uh, but you guys like fun, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this guy here doesn't seem to care for it. What's, what's your fucking problem, dude? <laughs> do you like fun? Well, tell your fucking face, okay? <laughs> <laughs> He's been watching Russell Wilson on primetime. He hates fun. <laughs> no shit. I guess, uh, I guess if I was wearing a jersey, I would be really fucking depressed, yeah. too. Yeah. I'm wearing a jersey of a guy who got hemorrhoids to keep him from hitting 400 once, <laughs> and I don't feel as bad as I do for you. That was my excuse, too. Sure it is. That's yeah, why yeah. you never hit 400. Yeah, that's why I never made it to the bigs. Yeah, the roids. Yeah, that's what it is. Well, that and your part wolf. Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. 100%. Yeah. You can't throw for shit. See, that's how you can tell the real fucking fans. Yeah, they got the wolf and the baseball gym. Call me down. <laughs> there's not many of them here. No. Most of them. <laughs> no. There's like four actual fans here and then a bunch of fucking wives who are like, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we're going to do with our fucking afternoon? Fine. Again, still sorry. All right? Yeah. Okay. She's got that look. I'm like face. Reese's. Sorry. Not sorry. I think it's actually for the first time. Maybe she's actually the only one that's kind of rooting for me. Do you think that's possible? No. Just shake no, your head no. no. Shake your right. head no. no. Or just sit there, stare at There you go. I'll take it. Anyways. Who are we talking about? Uh, nobody. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> you weren't paying attention anyway. No, I wasn't. Uh, I don't have headphones on, Scotty. Oh. Well, I do. I have earbuds in. You can't see them. I'm... I'm listening to some fucking, uh, what? Some fog hat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Slow ride. Oh, sure. Love good. it. Just Thank over you. and over again, I got it on a loop. Yeah. Okay. They Fair. know who that is. Yeah. Of course they don't. <laughs> well, I think I went too fucking far back with that Teletubbies reference. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard of who these fucking things are. I have no idea. I never actually watched it. Paw right. Patrol, is that better? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was my Paw Patrol peeps. <laughs> what the fuck? I got a worse one. They are not old enough to be in here. I know. <laughs> no, this, is, this one's going to really give it away. Bubble guppies. Thank fucking God. We're good. We at least have teenagers. I, again, I wasn't listening. What did you say? Nothing. Don't good. worry about it. I think he said Bubba Gump. Yeah. Bubba Gump. Oh, shrimp. <laughs> shrimp. Yeah. 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 Dude. Good shit. Right? He had, he had a whole fleet of Jennies. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we do have some more fun stuff, the actual fun comedy part of the show, but... When do we get to that? Yeah, when you stop talking, when I'm talking. I thought I was supposed to be talking. No. I, Shh. I, Zip it. I specifically called for your mic to be cut. That's true, he did. <laughs> Levi! Levi, what the fuck? <laughs> fuck, <Susan. man. laughs> Before we get to the fun stuff, every single episode, we have to give a shout-out to our sponsor, and... I We're wish gonna, we had somebody who could come in absolutely. and give them a shout out. 100%. Um, and guess what? We you guys do. know of anybody? Yeah. Yeah. Of course they don't. There's only four actual fucking fans here. Uh, <laughs> it's what? That's right. Uh, of but course, it's four In Manscaped. order to give a shout out to Manscaped, out of all of the guests we've had on the show, who would be the best one to do a Manscaped? <laughs> Mr. <laughs> JP! <laughs> I just used that this morning. You did? Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, he felt at some point he'd be showing yeah, you folks I don't his balls. I would never lick Scotty's uh, manscaped. <laughs> what? It's so small. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I expected it to be bigger. It's got to get to nooks and crannies and stuff like that, man. Okay. You got a, a fucking nooks, tropical Scotty. forest JP's got downstairs. I mean, That's Jesus. Right. That's right. But, a fucking chainsaw, gas powered. Right. I was hoping that you could illustrate how. No, I'm just kidding. Fucking kidding. Please don't do that. No! <laughs> <laughs> you 
in the Jeremy Joseph t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Get up here. We have a guarantee going on this show. <laughs> JP put out himself. I wish any of this was being picked up on microphone. I wish so bad. Are you saving tires? But I'm making your Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's 4.0 now. We're on 4.0, dude. That's right. <laughs> to be fair, we booked him over a year ago. <laughs> He's going to be closing down the joint. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, who, who in here uh, gets products from Manscaped? Yeah, Just a round of applause. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Raise your yeah. fucking hand. Yeah. That's awesome. Oh, but check That's what out. I wanted to see, hand raising. <laughs> that really JP, comes across on that. the audio feed. Check them out at manscaped.com. Use the promo code SIDELINES. Get 20% off of your order and free shipping. That helps us out. That helps you out. And lets Manscaped know that we do all of our commercials for Manscaped word for fucking word. Yeah, they, they actually wrote that out, dude. They wrote that I, out. I can't I, really I, remember that. That was me. All those fucking all lines. And, and congratulations <laughs> to this guy. He should win some kind of a fucking award he for will. supporting actor. <laughs> he will. Give it up for this guy in the Carhartt shirt. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. We're just going to call him Big Bush for the rest of the show. Yeah. He could win Scotty's Manscaped. Ooh, I'll what? sign it. Well, th that's not a prize <laughs> man, at that point. That devalues yeah. it, like, so much. It, does. much. it really does. Yeah. Uh, Seriously, no. that would detract from the value of just about anything. Yeah. That, it, yeah. I saw what it did for your fucking your, your, uh, home title. Yeah. But dude, your fucking home went down in value so yeah. much. <laughs> you can actually buy Scotty's house right now. It's on the market for $35,000. Yeah. 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 The address is actually That's one. Stop, fucker. Uh, Just give him a call. It's 316. No, I'll kill you too. Four, six. Nine. Stop it. Boy, that's one numeral Seven. you've never gotten before. I'll be honest with <laughs> you. Uh, but anyways, we're going to do something a little bit different since we have JP... Uh, and we're not going to do a, a lot of the same stuff that we do, but we decided to come up with a new segment. I uh, did. Yeah. This is going to be called Jeremy Joseph's Random Topics. So he gets to pick a topic that none of us know about, and we get to elaborate on that. So, yeah. Jeremy, what is the first topic? You should all just know that this just came from whatever the fuck was flying around in here. <laughs> so, uh, get ready. <laughs> Holy shit, there's a Broncos fan here. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Fuck, there are two of us. That dude needs a shaving. <laughs> so what's the first topic, Jeremy? Uh, rum raisin ice cream. Rum, what's that all about? Rum raisin <laughs> ice cream? Yeah. Look, I'll put a lot of stuff in my mouth. You sure will. <laughs> but not rum raisin ice cream. No. That's fucking disgusting. It sure is. That's I, gross. I preach gotta, it. Preach it. I honestly got to say, I don't think I've ever had rum raisin ice cream. Of course you haven't. You, you don't go anywhere. You don't do anything. You're fucking, your wife keeps you at home, trapped in the basement with those kids. Uh, <laughs> you feed them ice cream. What do you feed them? Yeah, yeah, she certainly do doesn't let you fucking shave. <laughs> No, what, I don't. What does rum raisin taste like? Uh, it's rum shit. and raisins. That's oh, what it tastes so like. It tastes like shit. Oh, it tastes it's like, horrible. It tastes like shit. Who wants booze and fucking raisins in their food? <laughs> yeah, yeah. The booze, at least, I'll take that. Raise in your food, hands. come on. Of, of the two alcoholics, we both raised our hands. So. And why am I the only one drinking? <laughs> yeah, I guess no, Derek is. I am too. I have to tolerate Scotty's somehow. I'll be honest with you, uh, folks, uh, in case you're wondering, Derek's actually just drinking water. That's what comes out of the tap here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, uh, Don't drink yeah. the water. You're going to want to order some drink drinks. Fresh so. in from Flint, Michigan. Mm -hmm. That's uh, <laughs> Ouch. Damn, what about you? Do, you? do you like rum raisins? Of course he does. Look at him. He likes anything. Yeah, absolutely. If it's Jesus got the word Christ. ice cream in it, yeah, I'm going to fucking eat it. Yeah, he's going to eat it. I, I would never have guessed. 
Yeah, right. Who'd have fucking thought that I, I like ice cream? Mm -hmm. I just talked about it on stage. I'd suck a dick for Rocky Road. Oh, it's true. Uh, That's a whole different story. <laughs> I'd like a uh, Rocky Road up here, please. <laughs> to the stage, Rocky Road to the stage. I'm just kidding. I'd never let you suck my dick here. Like, <laughs> He's a giver. Yeah. <laughs> How about you, JP? Did you, did you say you liked it? Where were you five minutes ago? Not paying attention. No shit. When I said yeah. it's disgusting. You I'd rather like, put a dick in my mouth. Fuck it? I mean, are fuck you okay, it? man? Yeah. Are you sure? Are you nervous? No. You've never been on stage before in front of people, all 30 of them, and they're all staring right at you. Yeah. Uh, I, I wish that were true. No, but that's not it. You're it, just dumb. No, yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. good enough. Let's uh, carry on. Unfortunately, I have been on stage once before. You have. Uh-huh. <laughs> and and he, he actually has kind of a fashion runway in front of those kids in the basement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does. Yeah. He'll come out and do a little twirl. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, he tries on all his different clothes, mostly his, his stupid fucking self-made jersey. And belts and a wonderful uh, yeah, array of hey. boas, huh? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, not the actual feather stuff, snakes, snakes, yeah, really, yeah, absolutely. What, okay, yeah, I turned around, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, no of course shit. You, fucking, you should huh? really fucking focus. You're the host of this show. I quit, <laughs> I fucking quit. No, how you been, JP? We haven't seen you in a while, though. Man, I've been good, man. I've been, yeah. I, I, you know, I mean. I've been waiting for you to call me to be on the podcast again and every Monday night by the phone and it doesn't ring and it yeah. doesn't ring and I cry a little bit every time, man, because I love you guys and I want to be here permanently and I really think we should just fucking get rid of Derek. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. And do the damn thing. Hey, you know what I mean? Thing. I mean, I do love Derek, but... Just, just tell him it's baseball it. season year-round, dude. Right. You gotta fucking <laughs> <get it>. yeah. <laughs> No, man, I've been good, though. I, I'm uh, not the punching bag, Jason Peterson. No, I, finally, I love it. I, I love it. F hey, man, last name, bro? Yeah. I don't want these people stalking me. Oh, oh yeah, you do. Yeah, I do. Yeah, 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 yeah I, do. I do. Especially that Broncos fan. <laughs> <laughs> I think we have a lot in common, my friend. He's got a shamrock on his hat. Maybe you'll yeah, get lucky. Yeah, you can oh, I'm <laughs> fucking getting lucky. <laughs> Let me get a drink down here for the Broncos fan, but bring it to me first. <laughs> yeah. One roofie colada, please. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, but no, you came in today. You looked all dressed up and everything. I like thought that. this was like a live show, so I wanted to look good. Yeah, you did. You looked, you looked like in your off time you work on you motorcycles. Were doing. <laughs> yeah. we, were, you know we were hanging out upstairs in the green room, right? We were. I sat next to you. I damn near got a fucking contact high from uh, just sitting close to you. Hey, hey, that's not legal hey, it's here. legal now. Uh, yeah, is it? No. Oh. <laughs> but as far as I'm concerned, it is. <laughs> I guess it's a ticket now. It, that's it? If you, well, unless you're, like, driving while you're high, which... <laughs> since I'm high most of the time, I do. But if you just get pulled over and it's in your car, they just give you a ticket. Don't even take it They don't time. even take your shit. Wow. Obviously. Not a baby. Way to go, Kansas. Yeah. <laughs> We're very pretty. Except for the fact that fucking Oklahoma's ahead of us right now. Okay. I feel so, good about it. So getting caught with weed is just a ticket in the state. As is Unless you offer to blow the cop and he accepts. And then you get off scot-free. <laughs> and they'll accept. Have you ever seen cops? Not the not the best looking dudes in the then world. Then you get to give him a ticket, and he's got to show up for his court date. That's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right. And that's a court date you don't want to miss. So getting caught with weed is a ticket, as is public urination. Correct. What about if somebody publicly urinates on you? I've never gotten caught. <laughs> <laughs> JP, I've got a weird vibe here. I have a question. Are you a homosexual? Um, here's the thing. I hate to categorize myself as a homosexual. I think that I just like to fuck dudes more than I like to fuck girls. <laughs> girls. He, he's not wrong. Pussy's I mean, getting old, it's right? Like, it's, it's like a 96% 4% thing. Like there's, <laughs> so, I mean, I would fuck a girl as long as she had a penis. Oh. <laughs> and they're out there now. Yeah, so, yeah, they are. They yeah, they are, are dude. I've, I've got no. porn sites dedicated to them. No, no, Jeremy, clear this up. There are. No oh yeah, that's true. Clear it up. There, there are no chicks with dicks, just dudes with tits. There it is. And uh, <laughs> what is? Which <laughs> I, I don't know, and I don't care. Um, how was the parade? 
<laughs> you know, I'm not that guy. No. I'm not, I'm, no, I'm not the guy that goes waving the flag. Bullshit, down, no. you're the fucking grandmaster, dude. No. No? No, you would think you're, yes, but no. No, he drives the float. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Honks the horn. Yeah. And, and he gets pulled over for fucking weed in the car. That's right. <laughs> I have never been pulled over for weed in the car. They find it afterwards, but that's not why they pulled me over. I was going to say, maybe you should. That seems like a surefire way to suck somebody's dick. Uh, it would, yeah, yeah. If I ever get hard up enough, yeah, I might do it. I'm, I'm going to say you would. I would. I know. I know. I, I planned know. on on the way home tonight. Oh, I'm sure. So, so anyways, JP, not to, to get too serious and not to bring things down, but uh, as we've talked about many times on the show, uh, you being a homosexual gentleman, how has that affected you in the real world, and what was it like coming out uh, as a gay man in the world? It was really easy for me, uh -huh. um, except for emotionally. Right. Oh. Like, emotionally, it was really, really hard. And Tell I don't us like about it. I don't normally like to talk about it, but since we're doing a live show, sure. Uh, I remember I was probably 15 or 16 years old, and I decided that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, dude. Time's up. Uh, That's JP. JP. That's JP everybody. Everybody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would have loved to have heard the end of that, but dude, we're on a schedule here. We only have the stage till eight, and I, don't, I have no idea how long this yeah, is going to We go. got a clock, JP. Just yeah. speed it up. Yeah. No shit. Jesus, Jesus Christ. Fucking boring. Oh. But uh, we're going to move on to our next guest, and he's part of my family. This is uh, probably my best friend in the entire world. Uh, will he admit that? Yeah, I think he will. He said no. Thanks, asshole. Um, <laughs> He was the best man in my wedding. He's the funniest person in my family. Welcome, my brother, Fred! Slash Fred. Kiss, 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 kiss! Ah, yeah. <laughs> Won't be the first time. Good. He went straight open mouth. He yeah. went for it like he Is does that what your grandma time. does? <laughs> ah, damn. Yeah. How else would you just kiss Scotty? I have no idea. I'm fucking shaking. I wouldn't even shake you his hand. You have to open wide to get around that beard. Yeah. Do you about Tom Brady? I would. I'd like to see this happen. <laughs> I would. I would actually like to see this kiss happen. No. Well, maybe afterwards. Okay. Levi, you getting this on camera? They're gonna kiss. <laughs> Proof. Yeah, he's got it. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh uh, shit. So yeah, it was actually kind of a funny story. Uh, there was one weekend where I believe Derek couldn't make it. Yeah, just one. One? Yeah, just one. <laughs> just one time I could not no, make it. Derek couldn't make it. JP couldn't make it. Steve couldn't make it. Dan couldn't make it. And I went Hail Mary. We went for our last fucking yeah, choice. Yeah, you see, we the called glasses. And then, and then that guy though. couldn't make yeah. it. <laughs> and then that guy couldn't yeah. make it. And I called my brother, and he's like, yeah, sure, I'll be right over. Came over and had... On, I'm not going to fucking say it. I'm not going to say it in all seriousness because I will get did fucking he just what, said it. What number what? did he call you on? No. I heard it. 316-464. Uh, 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 yeah. Uh, stop. Thanks. Appreciate it. Wow. We yeah, keep we'll progressing. We'll get one digit at a time. Fucking shit. Okay. That's the way you like to get fisted, right? One digit at a time. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Absolutely not. I don't like any digits up there. They don't belong there. We know what I heard. That's not the rumor I heard. Of course, I started that fucking rumor. But <laughs> <laughs> I made it all the way back around. Uh, but no, it was one of my favorite episodes we ever did. I had such a good time with, with my family, with my brother. So You hear that, Derek? It was his favorite fucking episode. <laughs> How does that make you feel? <laughs> fucking piece of shit. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's Heck. because, you know, we're all friends. My favorite episodes are the ones that I'm not on, too, so I that's know. all right. That is <laughs> yeah, as thanks. far away as I can be from you, the happier I am. I don't even beat my wife in those days. Wow. Yeah, that's uh, new. Hey. Wow. Okay. But you want to. <laughs> right. Oh, well, she just gets me so mad. <laughs> <laughs> wow, we lose them at spousal abuse. <laughs> <laughs> right. Real quick. Real quick. Have you guys listened to the fucking show? You know what we talk about? <laughs> this is fucking mild mannered compared to the normal shit. That's because Let's talk they're... about Scotty getting fisted. <laughs> That's, That's okay they're... though. That's okay. Yeah, yeah. sure. That's Just one ditch right at a time. There. They're right there. That's why. Who? The he guy in the, the JP's gonna shave? <laughs> <laughs> in the Broncos? Get ready. Uh, okay. Next topic. Jeremy's random topic. What's the next one? Uh, string cheese has string in it, or cheese in it. Hamstrings, no ham. Why? Oh. 
Oh, Make something oh. of that, you prick. Wow. <laughs> Derek could. He, he's really... One more time for the people yeah, in the back. Really, I don't think they understood yeah. you. String cheese is made of cheese, but hamstrings have no ham. Okay. Okay, we know what a string is. A string has got to be like the... Twine. Write it up Twine. on the big fucking like, board. Yeah, huh? can you type it up there for me? I can't yeah. understand. Uh, <laughs> that should be our new fucking, like, billboard. <laughs> oh, yeah? When people click on the show. Oh, okay. They, there's no way we have any fucking listeners after this. 100% true. But... Let's Maybe try. the ham community. People came from fucking San Diego to Why? hear this bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> He's a paid Weather actor. too fucking nice That's for it. you? What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, exactly. We paid that guy to come all the way from San Diego. I'm sure. Five bucks. Yeah. Dude, uh, I don't get bucks. paid a fucking thing to do this show. <laughs> what the hell? I know. <laughs> I'll no, do it on my no. fucking Mondays or Tuesdays. Why does, so why does hamstring, What? Hamstring doesn't have ham. Oh, Jesus yeah. Christ! For fuck's sake, Scott. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know why. There's stupid names for everything, right? Yeah, like Scotty Gurman. Let me change that's the cool. subject. Yeah. Teletubbies, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, Teletubbies, Teletubbies, that's two. You want to go back to the fucking rum raisin? That was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> no? You never fucking heard of rum raisin? You, you heard of hamstring? Yeah, you heard yeah, of hamstring. Yeah, of course I heard of hamstring. String cheese? Pe- uh, NFL players. I had a hamstring those. sandwich once. Or polos. <laughs> yeah, pole. Yeah, pole. Easy, Dahmer. Yeah, hamstrings. Love that guy. He's a real rascal. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but no, what do you think about hamstrings, there, Jim? I think you're ruining the fucking show. That's every what I fucking think. time. Like I say, get Carhartt up here to fucking host. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> might do a little better job. Anybody got his fucking lumberjack friend? Whatever. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> he looks awesome. I'd, I'd have a beer with that guy. Anyway, Fred, you're running short on time. Come on. Oh, <laughs> it's, all, it's all on me. You know, uh, yeah. absolutely. So all I've, of I've it. obviously never had hamstrings. Right. The, the, yeah, the, I wasn't even born with them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. Um, but string cheese. Bullshit. You've never had hamstrings. I've never had hamstrings. Yeah. But <laughs> string cheese. Shit. String cheese. I have. Of course you have. You're yeah. a fucking child. Duh! I eat yeah, chicken fingers cups everywhere too. I go. Where's That's my true. snack pack? Yeah. Yeah. Where's my <laughs> snack pack? How many? Okay. I, I, I have a question. How many guys in this room right now, when they go any restaurant and they have chicken fingers, they order chicken fingers? Holy fuck. Yeah. That, one. I, the, the Cardinal wow. fan. Again, this is fan. primarily an audio podcast, so we need applause, not <laughs> show of hands. <laughs> this is not third grade math. Wow. If the oh, one yeah. Cardinal fan, Nobody that must be those. a thing. It probably yeah, of yeah, course yeah, is. My 14 year old daughter eats those. I know. Have I, you ever had Cardinal fingers? Cardinal fingers? And if not, why not? <laughs> Give him a microphone. Give, Give him a bunch of children up. locked in your basement. Give him yours, Scotty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, that blows my mind. Am I really the only one that does that? Yeah, you're yeah. a fucking child. Yeah. Yes, ah. Scotty. All right, well. I Do they give you chopsticks to eat them with so you can feel like you're with the rest of the adults at yeah. a Chinese restaurant? <laughs> yeah. yeah, 100%. He, he can't use those either. Good, good yeah. for you. Yeah. What have you been up to, Fred? Have you gone to Disney? Yeah, Disney Fred, you're the fucking guest. Uh, no, but we're looking at booking a Disney cruise. Fuck! That'll be after the first of the year, Jesus so we'll see. Christ. I've never been to Disney once. You've never taken me. What the You're fuck? always busy. This is true. I I gotta gotta why in the fuck would he take you with him? Have you heard what a fucking drag you are yeah, on the show? they don't serve chicken strips. Shut up. I can't. I'm fucking co-host. I'm keeping this shit running. That's true. That's 100% You got true. a couple hours to go. Can yeah, you make it? We sure do. Oh, in God. fact, uh, my mouth is getting a little dry. Can I get another uh, beer up here, please? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Thank you, Scotty. Thank you for granting my fucking wish of another beer. <laughs> you can't do a goddamn thing about it from where you're sitting. I know. I didn't realize somebody made you general of the fucking bar. I, they should have. Look at that. You can't keep the empty one. Fuck By the way, guys, uh, yep. thank you to Vorshay's Lounge for uh, putting yes. up with our nonsense here. Uh, yeah, make right. sure. Uh, I'm going to take very good care of her at the end of the night. Uh, be sure and take care of your wait staff, too. Absolutely. Uh, but no, so you're, going, you're thinking about going on a Disney cruise? Uh, we, we'd like to. They removed that vaccination. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So. The girlfriend wants to. Who knows we will. Okay. Which, by the way, as you can tell, I'm wearing my only sports T-shirt tonight. I'm very Just proud of you. you guys. I thought that, that was about the Broadway play. Cats. Yeah. They don't. They don't. I, I secretly, Broadway. it is the backs autographed by the cast members. Awesome. Oh, no, nice. No. That is sweet. The girlfriend I'm made me wear it. She's got the matching shirt on. So that's impressive. But uh, oh my god. Wow. wow. I didn't know they could tattoo loose puss so good. Somebody's been doing yoga. <laughs> Ooh. This yeah, that's no a, bullshit. I'm putting him on the in, spot. That's how he's lost all the weight is DDP yoga. No shit. Uh, and methamphetamines. That too. That's yeah, number that one. 
mostly methamphetamine, so I can fuck Scotty's sister. But it's it's sexually it's an STD. It's a sexually transmitted drug. Right. That is, it sure uh, is. Yeah. <laughs> Good grief. So over the last what has it been? Yeah, like get back to his fucking shirt. That's yeah, exciting. Fuck. Oh, we won. No, no, three and a half years, almost as almost four. That we've been doing this podcast? You got two goddamn Four long years long. in January, Scotty. Oh, fuck. Why am I the one who knows that? I don't give a shit about this yeah, show. I don't know. So in three and a half years, in the times that you've been on the show, do you like doing the show? I do. I do. You no. know, the sports part sucks, but... Yeah. You don't know a fucking thing about <laughs> it. Oh, fuck no. Who cares about sports? Why don't you like sports? Everybody else in our family does. You know that uh, TikTok song, Scoop the Dirt, yeah. Throw the Dirt? Uh-huh. That's sports to me. Oh, God. Throw the ball, catch the ball. Me too. See? Yeah. That's all I know about sports. I know. So that's what I get for coming on the sports Whatever podcast. Whatever fucking song he's talking about. You play defense. I sure did. I'm more of a, of a defensive expert myself. Right. Uh, that's, really, that's really how I get down. That's the way I roll. Uh-huh. Or I stop it from rolling, really, with my glove. I, I really flash the fucking leather out there on the t-ball field. Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to see that. <laughs> you got your highlight reel? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, but no. Um, Any other questions? I didn't realize I was the one getting fucking interviewed I'm here. To Jesus. Ask <laughs> oh, let's go. Yeah. Well, he asked me questions, Scott. Well, you want to fucking fight about this? You want to leg wrestle? Right out here. <laughs> <laughs> fucking leg wrestle. <laughs> Absolutely, I'll do be, it. Be careful with that. What? Leg wrestling? Yeah. That DVD right, dude, yoga. I got some fucking hands. No strings. <laughs> no strings. Just hands. <laughs> Full so, on. Would you do DDP yoga? I would. Really? Once a day. Once a day. Understand this, it involves a lot of my penis insertion into uh, orifices on your body. That's that's how it works. You don't know how that works. Uh, Scotty just talked you into something. You agreed to something. You're contractually obligated now. I do that all the time. Let's actually bring out our yoga dummy, JP, everybody. (laughs) Come on, Rebecca. (laughs) Uh, No, it's been absolutely awesome to have you step in. Kind of means a lot to me. I know it's kind of sappy and shit like that, but having your brother be a part of a show that's doing well, it like really means a lot to me. So thank you very much. Thanks, hey, no, uh, thank growing up guys, with Scotty, for... tell us, tell us oh, yeah. a good story about growing up with Scotty. Oh God! Anything way for too fuck's many. sake? Anything good? Way too many. No, nope, you nope. can't fucking come up with a goddamn thing. I, can do, you? I better not do it in public. That's a. No, no, I'll say going for the show just, when just there's not people up. here. Okay, give us a good childhood story. Just anything. Uh, memorable mem- memory we from used your, to, uh, uh, I used from to, parents, I was old- grandparents? No, not about his grandparents. I was the older one, mm-hmm. so he'd make me buy all of his uh, chew. He used mm-hmm. to chew a lot. And dad came up to me one time and was mm-hmm. like, are you fucking buying that for him? I was like, no. Why would I do that as I'm smoking my cigarette? <laughs> and then, so and he'd uh, take him to his bedroom at night, spit in a water bottle, and put it under his bed. And <laughs> Sorry, dude. You gotta go. <laughs> Everybody, <laughs> play. <laughs> we we got time restraints. Seriously, we only have the fucking stage for so long. Oh goodness gracious! Clock guys, we gotta have. Clock. I would have really liked to have heard that story too, man. It sounded like a good one. It involved you, but other than that, it sounded like a great story. It takes story. longer than Scotty mm. drafting fantasy football. Jesus Shut the Christ. Fuck oh, up. Jesus Christ. You probably got to pee, don't you, since yeah. you got to be on stage right now? Yeah, don't worry. Don't use this soap. Save some time. Yeah, don't wash your hands. Yeah. Uh, anybody who wants to shake Scotty's hand after this, <laughs> don't. <laughs> I fucking hate these One guys, by the digit way, right at a time. <laughs> nope. That's how he likes it. No. The story that they're referring to, I'm going to tell. Because I'm going to embarrass myself. Fantasy football is actually how this show came together. Um, I had never met Oh, then Jeremy. you're out of the league. Huh? Then you're out of the league. Yeah, thanks, man. No, Jeremy Joseph was actually his first year. In <laughs> <laughs> Nobody wants to hear this bullshit. <laughs> never mind, move on. <laughs> Moving on. Um, we've got another guest that we're going to bring out, our last guest. Um, God, man, this guy's traveling all over the country doing stand-up comedy. He's been a very good friend of the podcast for since we started, and he, he is... He owns this bar, so he, he is, made us he put him on here. He this bar, so please give a warm welcome to Mr. Esteban Steve Peter! <laughs> Fuck yeah! All right, Steve Peters, everybody. Yeah, Steve, Peters, everybody. Steve Peters, everybody. Steve Peters, everybody. I just realized I did not introduce myself you the did. whole time. You were keeping it. Dude, you're too famous for that. They know exactly who you are. Yeah, the kid from the Sandlot. 
Yeah, as an adult. Yeah, that is true. No, 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 no. Say it. You know Say it, you dude. You're killing me, Smalls. <laughs> Say no. it. No. No, I can't. You're right. He, he actually charges a $1,000 to say that every <laughs> time. No. And everybody go with me on this. I swear to God, if you disagree, you're wrong. Listen to him talk and tell me it doesn't sound like Jim fucking Gaffigan. Hot pockets. Yeah, I'm yeah. telling you. It's, uh, <laughs> I get that a lot. Actually, I got that last week. No, a couple weeks ago, I was in Mex- New Mexico, and I was at a casino doing stand-up there, and they said that uh, I, I actually... So I met a <laughs> somebody fucking bragging. I met a waitress. Gigs I, I met got. a waitress and I called her brother and convinced him that I was Jim Gaffigan. So yeah. that was fun. That was all right. So you are a fraud, right? Yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. I've Definitely. been saying that about well, you for years. I have to sit next now. to the fucking leprechaun. I don't know why I'm over here with the. All right. Who loves shamrocks? Go shave him. <laughs> <laughs> Did somebody have on an I love Jeremy Joseph shirt? He's right they, there. They, I hope they Dude, have that's amazing. I like that's to think that this podcast has convinced him to think otherwise. Probably. <laughs> yeah. he, now, now he has one that says, I like Jeremy Joseph. Yeah. It's a <laughs> real big attitude. By the end of this deal, it's going to say, Jeremy Joseph I, is all right. Yeah, I can tolerate <laughs> Jeremy Joseph. Yeah, I wish he was nicer to Scotty. <laughs> No, but you've been traveling all over the country. As I have, man. Doing, I have. You got any yeah. good, decent stories at all? No. No? Yes. No, Thank no. you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I took that right out of Jeremy Joseph's book. I actually was in Miami last week, and I've been trying to do better. I've been trying to lose weight and stuff, so I actually went to the gym. Have you tried DDP those, yoga? <laughs> I get to fuck you during yeah, it. Yeah, this fucking idiot loses 50 pounds by stretching. That was weird. I don't 52, know. jack off. Yeah. That's only short. I feel like there was gastric bypass involved there somewhere. There may have been some surgery. There was. I was literally, literally in Miami last week, and I was at the gym. And I'm in South Miami, so it's 97 degrees with 100% humidity. And there is a sign on the wall. I swear to you, it says this: "Perspire to succeed." I just feel like that's not needed in South Florida. (laughs) You know. There's a lot well, of I was, leaving, down I was there. leaving the parking lot. I saw a homeless dude that was begging for money. I just rolled down my window. I was like, bro, just sweat more. You're going to do it. It's awesome. Yeah, he is yeah. succeeding his ass. Yeah, yeah. 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 for I, sure. I like to think you changed that guy's life. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you know who that guy dude. was? Yeah. Bill fucking Gates. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, Jeremy, you've got your last topic. That sucks. What's yeah. your last topic? Uh, yeah, they topic? all suck, dude. I know. Uh, Pussy farts. Uh, now we're going. All right. I like this one. Right. What was the loudest you ever heard, and what was her shoe size? <laughs> <laughs> Ten and a half. <laughs> <laughs> How loud was it? Uh, I mean, she had a couple kids, so it was a, it was a fucking so it was a like a hot air balloon. Yeah. Sure. It was bad. What? Yeah, it was really bad. Oh, God. Damn. Well, it's just like when you get going, and it's... <laughs> You know what I mean? Like the whole... Yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah. You, get, you get a rhythm going. Yes. Yeah. And you just build it up and build it up. I might all, right, all right, all right, all right. Let's leave my fucking mom out of this. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's fucking gross, Steve. I don't need to hear it. Yeah. For me, it was 1997. I know how to play. <laughs> For me, it was 1997. Uh, sweaty hobo in Miami. Oh, God. Succeeding, he, obviously. Obviously. Uh, obviously <laughs> yeah. After some advice that he fucking got. <laughs> and uh, so hard that it rattled the handle off my ALF coffee mug. <laughs> <laughs> Size eight and a half. Oh, so I literally story. thought a mouse just ran across the desk, but it was Jeremy fucking with this thing, and it flew across. This yeah, little, it scared the fuck out of me. Well, and I'm infested thing. with rodents. Yeah. I don't know if you knew that yeah. or not. <laughs> That's all. And crabs. <laughs> I, we're going to probably ask the person that has the least amount of experience about this. Uh, Mr. Derek, what do you think about pussy farts? Yeah, I don't make a lot of noise in there. <laughs> uh, it doesn't sound so much like that as it does like a dying giraffe. <laughs> oh, my God. Yes. <laughs> That's not a bad dying giraffe, folks. That's very accurate. <laughs> yeah. 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 And nine and a half. Not nine and a half? Yeah. Okay. A big foot for a gal. Or was it a gal? Yeah. It was a gal. Okay. Yeah. It, it wasn't a... a, a it was a Sheila. It, it wasn't a chick no with a No blokes. Dick. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Or a dude with tits. <laughs> yeah. No, no. I'm the dude with tits, man. <laughs> Seems like the I bigger the yoga. Seems when are you going to come fuck me? I mean, let's... <laughs> 
Seems like the Here, bigger let's get the into it. I can give you a discount on that fucking app. <laughs> the bigger the shoe size, the stinkier the feet, too. That's 100%. That's, that's fucking profound. Yeah. You heard it Very here first. Weird. You take that <laughs> on. You fucking put that on a bumper stick. Put it on a t-shirt, sir. <laughs> 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 that's how that works. Size nine. And, uh, Dan gets royalties. I'm like, <laughs> that fucking shirt, which I don't see shit from. I like to think you're marketing those. Yeah. Thank you. Totally. Sell them outside after the show. Uh, size nine, and uh, I'm the same as Derek. I, I never get late, so it doesn't. I don't have to worry about it. My wife just, uh, we, we kind of have an agreement that we both make a certain amount of money, and we help pay to live in the house that we live in. And, uh, yeah, she hates my guts. So you Sounds heard like folks, a second here for eight folks is uh, marriage is utilitarian. Could be. Yeah. It could be. That sounds like a Section 8 arrangement. Yeah. Is what it sure that does. Is. Yeah. Con- that is a, Section 8 like That's how Redneck man. Scotty's marriage is. It's Section 8 arranged. Scott, yeah. that's, that's pretty bad. Scotty I see a neighborhood has, he lives in. That's definitely Section 8 housing. Right. <laughs> Scotty actually has condom farts, is what he has. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Spermicide he it is like. <laughs> <laughs> That can't be possible. You actually have to stretch the sides of the condom in order for you to be able to make any kind of... It does look like a windsock sitting on a pencil, doesn't it, Scotty? <laughs> uh, if you see Scotty on the street and he has to fart, he'll make you a fucking wiener dog. <laughs> <laughs> there will be a rubber in there. It'll be slimy. Just take it as it comes. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, no, but uh, so do you have any co- uh, comedy shows that are coming around the corner, do you think? Uh, no, we have Chris Porter here in December. But other than that, we, I don't. I don't have any. I, here's the thing. I wait until the last minute. Somebody's like, "Hey, bro, can you be in like Texas tomorrow for a show?" I'm like, "Yeah, I can do that." And that's about how my bookings go. I don't. I don't book out like months in advance. I don't know why. Why? Because uh, you got to get funny. Or Probably no, I forget. Fucking yeah, I, forget. Yeah, I guess. I always forget, and I don't show up. So it's it's. You uh, do that everywhere. I know. <laughs> I kind of did that. Seriously, today. we had to call him at home to get him to come to this fucking that is show. True. This is That's totally It's like, true. dude, you remember you were scheduled to be here? Yeah. He's like, no, I didn't. Uh, is that uh, happening today? Traumatic brain injury. <laughs> well, do you have a so. do you have a, a question for Steve? Of course I do, Steve. You uh, you grew up in Chicago, right? Nope. <laughs> Great. <laughs> uh, hey, I do. Uh, I do love the city of Chicago. Is, is, is there any Chicago people here? Yeah. Is there any Bears fans, Cubs fans? Yes. yes. What the fuck? None of you. These that's fucking because... people, Steve. Oh, God. yeah, that's that. There it is. That, that does you seem like a lot of work, dude. You want to know what I just fucking stepped on? What's that? My belt. You fucking. Was it the yes. belt in my fucking wrist? My damn belt. Get rid of it. it. Fell over. Get rid of it. Oh, I'm putting it right down. Didn't you guys you know think you were a real fucking host of the show? You were going to auction that off? No. Yeah, I think no. so. You guys are going to give that away to somebody? Yeah, oh, that's, no. there's a lucky fan that's going to win both those belts. No, Do you not. think he wears that in his underwear at night? I don't think he even puts underwear on. I think that's, he why, his wife, that's why his wife won't bang him. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. What do you mean? You would hear a pussy fart if you didn't wear that. Exactly. He <laughs> <That's laughs> did not. Oh. Yeah, Yeah. he he farts. It's like a fucking hi-hat symbol. <laughs> 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 but to answer your question, I, yes, got... I wear the fucking belt, and no, I am not wearing any clothes. How do you fit it in belt loops? Huh? I know it's Steve's segment, but how do you fit it in your fucking belt loops, honestly? They, yeah. they snap, man. You got big pants, dude. I do. You're like a fucking clown. Didn't you Literally, get... you're like a fucking Didn't clown. Didn't you get pegged for a while? No! Who told you that? I don't know. Derek the said internet. that you were getting pegged. Okay, yeah. Steve, yeah. this is a matter of argument. What do you consider a while? <laughs> Two and a half weeks? Yeah, he did. I, that's what I thought. Dude, my wife is a bottom. I think his wife is a top. <laughs> no. I agree. Hey! She's here. Yeah, I know that, Scotty. Oh, okay. I wish she was hosting. <laughs> Honestly. No. Anybody. <laughs> Ouch. No, but do you have another question for Steve? Or any question for Steve? Yeah, any questions. Nope. Uh, oh, fine. <laughs> Such a dick. Steve, Steve, you've obviously uh, had a lot of childhood trauma. Yeah, hundred uh, percent. Growing what? up in Chicago, it gets that way. <laughs> I agree. That's why I didn't do it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Did you get lead adjacent? <laughs> sure. Uh, the streets are lined with lead, there, right? Yeah. Sure, yeah. they are. Uh, That's the snow plows just <laughs> plow lead during the in summer. In fact, uh, the cup Steve's drinking out of, by the way, lead. Um, yeah. yeah. Steve, uh, tell us just about any traumatic 
childhood experience, anything that helped shape you through a, a negative way, just go ahead and tell us a fucking story. My just whatever aunt, I have to do to get out of this fucking bit. My aunt shook me real bad one time because I wanted did. to leave where we were at. Well, she literally, well, she was, she kind of drank a lot, so she was a bit of an alcoholic. In her defense, uh, you are redhead. Yeah, so that that's yeah. true. That's a true right. part of the story. But I was only like nine, mm -hmm. and I was being a dick because nine-year-olds are dicks. And I was like, come on, can't we just leave? I know I was being a dick. So this really affected it's, you then. Yeah, huh? this happened. And then I started to uh, go outside, and she started shaking me. <laughs> like shaking baby. Sorry, dude. Right. Time's up. Time's See, Peter's up. everywhere. <laughs> I, don't, I don't feel like... Not making me heal. Dude, we're on a fucking time limit. You put it on, put us on it. Steve, yeah, Peter, we got the station yeah, at 8 o'clock. All right. Oh, shit. Well, I'm glad that fucking shit's over. But now... That just gonna... brings us one step closer to the end of this fucking shit show. <laughs> yeah. You know how many fucking listeners we've lost? <laughs> All of them. That's how many. <laughs> nope. Guess what? What? Let's fuck up, kids, because you're going to be involved in this next one. We are going to do overrated or underrated suggestions from you. Yes. Yeah. So gather them up, kids. Who, what are we doing first, overrated or underrated? Yell some out. Oh, yoga. Derek's yoga. Derek's he said. Yoga. It, I, I, I would. <laughs> you talking about three one six? Hey, stop. Four six. Stop. Stop. Four six one. No. <laughs> Ace, he's That's enough. There. I obviously know that person. I'm going to kick your ass after the show. Hey, he didn't threaten to kill you. So. All five foot seven of me. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> anyway. No, first overrated or underrated, we're going to do uh, uh, DDP yoga. I think that, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. What right. you, okay, go. Way fucking overrated. I'd never <laughs> do it. I'd certainly never spend my afternoons after work at home by myself in a fucking basement uh, that may or may not be wet. Uh, <laughs> listening to a former wrestler who's fucking washed up uh, tell me what the fuck to do. Never, <laughs> never in a fucking million years. No, it's it's uh, definitely underrated. I, I highly recommend it to anybody. And uh, if you want to do it, uh, no, don't talk to me about it. Just do it on your fucking own. Right. I don't give a shit. Derek says he's going to try it. Yeah, uh, says I, was, I was going to try it. Why, I, why aren't you? Because uh, I, I think it's overrated because I don't want to do anything Jeremy Joseph does. Mm. Oh, yeah, I, I got I to gotta be my own goddamn man. I can't think I'm just copying Jeremy with everything I do. I he came know. out earlier and did my entire fucking set. You saw how well that went. Yeah, plus I don't want to get penetrated, so I'm going to go overrated on this. I totally forgot about that penetration part. I'm I, also going to go overrated. Well, I am shocked. Call me shocked, Scotty. <laughs> that is... Really, you're so pro-penetration, really. Yeah. No, I'm yeah. not. Not what I heard. <laughs> Scotty pee, pee That's what we call you. Oh, That's... thanks, man. Appreciate it. Okay, next one. What are you offer for our next one? Queefs. Queefs? Queefs. Queef? Is that what it was? No, I like queef. For an unprecedented second time in this show, Pussy Farts has been brought up again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so are they overrated or underrated? I think they're underrated. That means sure. you're, you're going to work, man. Like, you are doing things. You don't right? know what the fuck I'm doing? Well, <laughs> this, is, this is true. But, uh, but no, that's like, a, that's like a pride of honor. Like, you are going to town good enough to make her pussy go, I'm good. I uh, See, I got to go overrated on this because I had a girl that, that I used to date in high school that could do it on command. Oh, <laughs> so... Yeah, I didn't realize that's what that was. We're sitting here watching TV, and I just hear... <laughs> and I'm like, what the fuck is that? And she starts giggling, and I look down, and she's fucking sitting Indian style with her feet together. And I'm like, you know what? Uh, I don't want to deal with that ever again. <laughs> so Derek had, knew a girl who could do it on a whim. Meanwhile, Scotty's one digit at a time. <laughs> How about you, Mr. Jeremy? I'm going to say that they are overrated simply for the fact that they sound like farts. Farts are fucking funny, and I have a hard enough time maintaining an erection as it is. <laughs> <laughs> Unless right. you're doing yoga. It would be like trying to do it with fucking Richard Pryor in the room. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next one. Hold on. I see you down here. I got a female yelling at me. What you got? Peggy. Peggy. <laughs> 
Scotty, we're going to go ahead and leave the stage and just give you all the time you need here. <laughs> Scotty is the expert on this. We're going to give you up to two and a half weeks. And we're just going to put this away. Go ahead, Scotty. Uh -huh. <laughs> I can't say if it's underrated or overrated because that means I admit it to get it get done. Uh, Here's the thing, Scotty. You thought we were coming to a live recording of this podcast. This is more of an intervention. Oh. We all, uh, we think you've got a problem. Listen, there, there are some people in here who just love you like crazy. Derek and I aren't one of them. But uh, <laughs> people here who just love you who really understand you have a problem. And uh, you wrote a letter, right? Read it to him. What? I put her on the fucking spot. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's, on me. That's, a, that's a bad thing on my part. She, she obviously is not a regular listener to this I show. Don't <laughs> what gave it away? Uh, the fact that she looked like I uh, verbally sexually assaulted her. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of did. Um, <laughs> but whatever. Go on, Scotty. Pegging. It's overrated. I don't like anything near the exit. It is an exit only. Overrated. All right. Derek loves it, though. Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, I'm going to say underrated when it happens to Scotty. Oh, thanks. Uh, very underrated. Uh, it just makes his day, you know? Uh, some people need a fresh cup of coffee when they get up in the morning to get started. Scotty just really needs a good pegging. Uh, so I'm going to go underrated for that. Uh, let's pep you up a little bit, buddy. It's overrated, goddammit. Okay. Jeremy? Oh, oh. Yeah, I, I, I got to fucking say so in this. I, I don't to skip you. Please, and thank you. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, I, I got to say that it's definitely underrated when Scotty gets pegged. And, uh, <laughs> dude, I have, I have video and uh, phone number for all you guys after the show. <laughs> if, uh, if you want to come up and, and get it from me, I, I can share it with you. Nice. Okay. Next. What is it? Oh, fuck you. <laughs> with, your, with your assless chaps, you son of a bitch. You know my stance on this. I'll fucking walk off the stage. <laughs> Assless chaps gets brought up again. Oh, uh, no. What I don't put up with bullshit. <laughs> what else? Oh, no. I heard that last one. What did you say? Cessna aircraft. I feel like everybody's looking at me all of a sudden. <laughs> I can tell you that they are uh, a horrible place to work. <laughs> uh, I, I can't tell you a, a whole lot of examples of their shit failing on them, but uh, if, you, if you appreciate, like, blood diamonds, sure. Yeah, <laughs> go ahead and fly on a Cessna aircraft, because that's what it took to make that fucking airplane. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> I, yes, Cessna aircraft. I thought we had that straight. Yeah, we did. He, he felt the need to say it a second time. He really <laughs> wants the fucking opinion on Cessna aircraft. Right. You know what? I've changed my opinion since the first time you said it. Uh, they're great. <laughs> <laughs> Love them. In fact, I have some applications if anybody needs a job. <laughs> okay. You can have my recommendation. Uh, they I'll really make... think highly of me since they fired me. Right. Uh, I want to make this really fucking easy. Those of you guys who listen to the show, you know I absolutely fucking hate flying, so you fuckers that make the goddamn airplanes, you're overrated. Fuck you. I'll drive everywhere I go. I'll, dr I'll drive out in the ocean. I don't give a fuck. I'll swim. No, there's sharks. Never mind. Who here wants That's to see Scotty time. drive in the fucking ocean? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! That's the response I needed. Oh, man. God. All right. How about you? I'm going to say underrated. Really? Yeah. Anywhere that lets you shit in the hallway is way under fucking rated. <laughs> I mean, when you got to go, you got to go, right? It is a poop, not shit. A poop? There you yeah, go. you got to leave when a you poop. You have to have a poop. And that will be timely cleaned up, okay? Really? <laughs> yes. In a way that is in procedure with all of the uh, hazardous waste material guidelines. After the chalk outline is complete. Okay. I don't carry chalk on me, but I'd like to. Yeah, you want to trace that. I'm going to start. I'd like to trace <laughs> yeah. that. In fact, that's, instead of autographs, we'll be uh, out front tracing anybody's poop. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We're going to do the last one, but uh, one, hold on. I actually got a text message from a guest who's actually here. I'm going to do yours. He's here? Yeah, he's here. 
That's exactly what yeah. I'm going to say. He has yeah. my phone number. Levi, if you could put his cell phone number I'll up on the big screen. I'll do his suggestion as long as he doesn't give away my fucking phone number. All right, so, so we're skipping him. No. Uh, <laughs> looking for some suggestions. No. Uh, and quit calling me. No, the first one, uh, i got to pull it up here because I uh, had to reject a phone call for somebody that's in the audience that's trying to fucking call me. Ooh, they figured it out. Yeah, no you shit. devils. No, I like this one, though. Uh, overrated or underrated, shorts below or above the knees? Well, which one? I would say that's above just shorts. the knees. Above the knees. Shorts above the knees. Overrated or underrated? Somebody really tight shorts. Oh, Bob Millette. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I... Uh, 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 <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go overrated. <laughs> yeah, shorts above the knees? Yeah. I mean, for those of you who fucking like to brag, your dick's going to hang out. But, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I'm 40. My balls are going to hang out. So I'm going to go uh, overrated on this. Uh, I am also going to go overrated. I, ah, uh, they're overrated, shush. I actually have to golf with Mr. Bob and uh, get to see those very, very short shorts that he decides to wear. Yeah. Kind of tight. They look a little tight and probably a little, uh, you know, they're kind of squeezing everything together. I'm out. So, how about you, Jamie? Oh, those are so underrated. I, I love Bob shorts. They, <laughs> the, the way that those things hug, I mean, it's like he's constantly taking his own blood pressure. It's, uh... <laughs> <laughs> he's going to yoga you so hard. He, he is. <laughs> I mean, oh. it's, it's like a cock ring for his legs. It's, <laughs> he can sit on the toilet for hours. His feet are just constantly asleep. <laughs> Okay, well, I actually have one more that's a surprise. Um, I uh, made arrangements to call a friend. And he oh, better Jesus fucking Christ, like you, you got fucking friends. You use that term very loosely, Scotty. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. that is, I'm Do you mean loose acquaintance that you paid $8,000 to accept your fucking phone call? Yeah, yeah. something like that. I Thank just you. so happened to Thank cameo. you. If he does answer it, I'm trying. Dude. Scotty cameo oh, Vin shit. Diesel. No, I that's did not. I swear to God, if you got Ozzy Smith. No. <laughs> no, it's not. It's going through, though. It's now starting to finally ring. You got to get better uh, stuff uh, to do this. But hey, you got a second? I do. Go ahead and do something. Yeah, because they can see that. Yeah. Everybody doing? Go ahead and say it again. You cut out. Listen, how's everybody doing? Justin Nutley! <laughs> Is that uh, Justin Danger, not only? Y'all were rocking the live show. Yeah, we're in the middle of the live show. What, so, are, what are we discussing? Well, we're doing overrated or underrated. Do you have any that you want to do? Yeah, let's go. What do you got? What you got? Uh, give me a next. Give me an uh, give me a overrated or underrated. No shit, you. What was that last one? Circus peanuts. Circus peanuts. <laughs> yeah. Overrated. 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 <laughs> Old peanuts are way better on the side of the road. <laughs> Old peanuts are better on the side of the road. D Jeremy, do you agree with him? I, I think Nunley needs to have a fun fact about circus peanuts for us. Do you? No shit. No, not circus peanuts, man. Bull peanuts is where it's at. <laughs> 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 all right, bro. I really appreciate you answering the call. You stay a good dinner. Yo. Is, is that always going to be on the fucking show? That doesn't seem worth eight grand. All right, you heard it. He's calling the Padres to win the World Series. The dads. Pod raising six. All right. Duly noted. You take care, buddy. See ya. All right. Yeah, I thought that would be pretty cool. But now we got to figure this out. It turns peanuts. out it wasn't. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Shut up. Circus Peanuts, what do you think? Are you sitting or standing right now? I'm. Fuck you. <laughs> I just want to know who the fuck I'm talking to. Is this seated Scotty or standing Scotty? I, now I, it's standing Scotty. Are you sure? Now it's sitting Scotty. Uh, no change. Okay, what do you got? Circus peanuts are uh, proof, in my opinion, they're way underrated. They are proof that evolution didn't really happen because that had to be food from God right there. That's the best <laughs> shit on earth, all natural. Who doesn't love a fucking circus peanut? <laughs> I'm going to go puke. I've, I've had them, I hate them. I'm, I, I'm you didn't need my fucking Spanglish, did you? No. <laughs> you cocksucker, that <laughs> bag's still at the house, isn't it? Yeah. It or is it in the walk. fucking trash with your fucking nice Jewish men calendar? <laughs> it could have been there, too. Absolutely. No, I had one of those, and they Race were absolutely disgusting, so I'm going overrated. Derek? I'm going underrated, because I got you assholes both to eat one. <laughs> <laughs> so...
<laughs> and that was probably the second best gift I've ever bought Jeremy Joseph. Nice. Uh, yeah, now. Yeah, now. Yeah, Before time. today, I would have said the best, and now, <laughs> now that fuck him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, now we're going to move on to questions or preguntas or Spanish questions. Uh, we had a couple of them written up before to where I can let these guys, uh, you know. Can celebrities. I make a celebrity phone call? Huh? <laughs> yeah, I, I can make a fucking phone call if I want to, right? Yeah. Yeah, go for it. I don't care. All right. Uh, anybody in here want to uh, talk, hear from my brother, Ed? <laughs> so, no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, Siri. I, no, she didn't listen to you. Ah, uh, fuck her. Uh, <laughs> she's... Siri is the Benny Ogbayani of fucking AI. Okay? <laughs> oh no, Benny uh, Ogbayani is okay. Is, this is a very important phone call, and hopefully he fucking picks up. Man, I bet you he will. I got it on speakerphone. I got fancy features on my phone. I don't want to fucking brag. I'm not an IT guy, but did he? He's give him a fucking second. No, you, you know he just quit for... fucking around. Yeah. <laughs> If you would just quit fucking around, we could keep going. Good point. Yeah, tough shit. I think he's, nope, he's gone. <laughs> no, it, it's still fucking ringing. My you friend asshole. answers my phone call. Edit this out. Hi, you Ah, uh, bye. Oh. See, I, Jeremy doesn't have any friends. That sucks. Not talking friends, talking brother. Oh, he family. Hey, <laughs> Jeremy Joseph, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> That You're right. the fuck out of me. You're right. I don't have a brother. <laughs> Not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> All right. We're going to start off with questions. So first question, what's something the worst roommate would do? Oh, take too much Ambien and force feed you scalding hot apple turnovers. <laughs> yeah. That's I'm what a bad roommate would do, but that. that's what a great father would do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to go steal your dog. I, I mean, that, that, Where's that, he going to fucking take it? He lives with you. No. <laughs> Hear me out. My roommate is your dog. No. <laughs> is my wife. And she stole my dog. Rescued your dog. Oh. <laughs> I, just got, I just got a text from your wife saying your fucking lease is up. Oh. <laughs> so apparently you're not roommates anymore. No, we ended up buying a dog to replace my dog who passed away, and now my new dog loves her way more than me. And that's Can you fuck I also got dog. another text from your wife saying she can't talk right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Jeremy? What? What's the fucking <laughs> question? What are you fucking bothering me for? <laughs> What's something the worst roommate would do? Fuck your dog. Uh, <laughs> Perfect. Uh, next Better question. than you could. <laughs> right. All right, next question. Who would be the worst athlete to have their own shoe line? Biddy on Bionni. Duh. Uh, yeah, me yeah, too. I'm, yeah. But I'm not He's an not an athlete. Yeah, I'm not an athlete. Uh, that's mine. Oh, he played college baseball. He'll tell you all the fuck about it. I did. I did. His first team all state back in 06. Played college in fact, baseball. we may have kicked Steve off stage too early. We got some time to kill. Tell him about it. Steve. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, my answer is Benny Agbayani. What's yours? Gary Boggs. Mm. I'm going to go with Michael Jordan, but the baseball player. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. How about you, Derek? I'm, I'm going to go with Oscar Pistorius. The, Thank you. That is the uh, great runner. Yeah, that is the legless renter that murdered his wife. <laughs> uh, girlfriend. That's girlfriend. Awesome. Sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah, the converse converse air widowmaker. That's so that is. Uh, oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. I dig it. All right. Next question. What would be the worst movie to watch in 3D? They came out with it, but I ain't watching Jaws in 3D. Like if they came out with a better Jaws in 3D, I would shit my pants. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm more scared of, of sharks than I am of airplanes. Fuck mm. that shit. Levi, roll it. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Derek? Uh, Ten-inch mutant ninja turtles. Ten-inch? Yeah, that's the porno parody of the teenage mutant ninja turtles. <laughs> <laughs> because you got a duck at the end of every scene. <laughs> like, oh, shit, fuck. <laughs> like that's... Oh, Jesus. How about you, Jeremy? I'm going with that porn parody of Toy Story. <laughs> <laughs> I said worst, worst, not best, worst. Because it'd be pretty fucking awesome. 
All right. You gonna fucking crank me here? Yep. <laughs> you wanna do this in front of all these fucking people? Yeah. Anyway. We'll next. fucking leg wrestle. Okay. I'm serious. <laughs> okay. It's next. happening. Next question. The NFL is looking to expand. Introducing the newest team, the blank. You know, uh, uh, I don't have the NFL. I have the NBA. Because, I mean, sports is getting real. The way they're doing things, like they, they, you can't have the, the Cleveland Indians anymore. And Boo. you can't have the Washington Redskins. Like, they're getting real PC. I'm surprised this actually went through. Uh, but the Hartford Honkies. Oh, damn. Yeah, uh, they, uh, they're a new NBA franchise. Oh, yeah? Yeah, uh, very fundamental. Yeah. Uh, very good at bounce passes. Yeah. Uh, a lot <laughs> of shot clock violations. But uh, You talk about some good layups. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Right. Draft a lot of Duke players. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I gotta Some of them went on to the Washington Generals, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Those guys are great. I got to give a shout out at least to it one time. I went with the Delaware Dongers. Because everybody in Delaware has got a huge dong. That's what I've been told. Why, they got to be white. I didn't say that. <laughs> yeah, you did. No, I didn't. I said it in my head. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I envisioned you saying it right up here, Scotty. Okay. It's on fucking tape. Okay. I didn't. Of me envisioning you saying that. <laughs> okay. Roll the tape, Levi. No. Nope. Yeah. No. Nope. <laughs> that Jaws nope. movie. Yeah. What about you, Jeremy? What about me? Yeah. What was, what was the question again? <laughs> the, the NFL team is looking to, or the NFL is looking to expand, introducing the newest team, the blank. The square pegs. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where are they from? Uh, wherever you're at. <laughs> Okay, fine. All right, this is the last question. Uh, this one has been requested many, many times from many, many listeners, so I'm glad we finally get to do it. This one is Awful Dr. Seuss Pickup Lines. All right. You want me to go first? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, mine always sucks, so I'll get it out of the way. Has anybody who's requested this actually here? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I I'm asking them, Scotty. <laughs> I was <laughs> waiting for Christ. some noise. All right, so I went with... Uh, You're going to hear some pussy farts all around the crowd. Yeah, <laughs> yeah by show of pussy fart. <laughs> who here requested this? Instead of a chair or a lonely place, would you, could you sit on my face? <laughs> I'll take it! I wrote that myself. Proud. Okay. How about you, Derek? Uh, I got a couple. Okay. Uh, uh, you're a beautiful woman. Let's keep it simple. Could you tell me, is this a sore or is it a pimple? Oh, gross. Uh, That's uh, gross. The, the last one I said, uh, everyone's staring. Look what you've started. Uh, was your father your brother? Because you look retarded. <laughs> God, that's beautiful. Uh, yeah, I slay some tarred puss. Uh, that is... Puss is puss, dude. Let's, oh, let's fix it. Jeremy, how about you? Uh, I can tell just by looking, you're one hot fox. I'd like to spend some time in that old stank box. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's questions and preguntas. I'm not, I'm not finished. Oh. <laughs> no, it's not. I hope that you know that I'm no creep. I just want to be in there about ankle deep. <laughs> <laughs> just know that I'll be bare and that ass that I'll tap. Consider it applause when I give you the clap. <laughs> Don't applaud me. Applaud Dr. Seuss. He was my inspiration on that. God damn. Can we get a wet floor sign for all the ladies down here? That <laughs> is, uh, yeah. that's... All three of them. <laughs> that's right. All right. Well, that's questions and preguntas. So, Levi, get ready, buddy. We're going to do a very popular part of every single episode. This is the Laughing on the Sidelines Draft. Is this a song we play for this? Yeah. I, I never listen. All right, fade it out there, Levi. Oh, boy. I can't you, you, all should, you all should know that this is the point in the show where we normally spend about an hour going, okay, what the fuck should we draft? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta pee. Yeah, yeah exactly. That's what happens here. Unless, Unless you're Jeremy Rush and then do it in the middle of the show. I was going to say. Discount Jeremy. So, yeah. yeah, discount Jeremy. When we first started or we first made the show, when we started doing drafts, um, we've done quite a few of them. Uh, and over the last... Uh, 
couple of what? It's been four months since I put, no, it was like two months. We actually put a- I don't know time, Scotty. Shut up. We actually put a picture on uh, both our Instagram and Facebook and said, if you are coming to the live show, make a suggestion on what we should draft and we will pick the best suggestion. Boy, did we have a fucking winner. I want to get, get them up here, so go ahead and start walking if you're upstairs. Tyler Corti, come on up here, buddy. All right, up front. Yeah. yeah. Wait a minute, is that fucking guy? Go sit back there. It was him the whole time. <laughs> no, thank you. Anything else but this fucking guy. So, I got a question. Are you a Denver Bronco fan, too? Uh, no. Good so, for you. that is a Tim Tebow jersey. He apparently oh. appears. Well, he has to be oh, so he's a Jesus fan. Yeah. Yes, he is a Jesus fan. Yes. <laughs> Needs to be in order to be a Bronco fan right now. Uh, did he have the match? He appears match to be a Pittsburgh Gorillas fan. Yes. Yeah. Based uh, on the 8 0 Pittsburgh State Gorillas won today. Oh, okay. okay. Did you go to school there? I did. What was 14th grade like? <laughs> <laughs> Alcohol. Yeah, that's a good way to So college, it. yeah. So uh, he is the winner of the, uh, the topic for this week's draft, and I know you guys are going to like this very much, and it's no question why he won. We are going to be drafting our favorite bands that Jeremy Joseph has managed. <laughs> To be fair, I have a little bit of a distinct advantage in this is that I know certain bands that I've managed that they don't even know about yet. <laughs> Holy shit, he's got a list. I did my research, Jeremy. Oh, I'm glad. So <laughs> when you research me, I'm incredibly, you should really look me up on fucking Wikipedia, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Just look up Jeremy Joseph. Uh, buy a fucking t-shirt if you want. Uh, <laughs> I don't get anything out of it. Uh, but no, so normally, uh, whenever we have a guest on, guest always goes first. I lost the draft, as I always do. Who won between you two? I don't fucking know. Don't okay, so that shit. means you talk first, then you, uh, you get the next pick, and then Jeremy, you get the championship picks, buddy. Because I'm the best, yeah. That's no shit you are. I mean, for fuck's sake. Okay. <laughs> Our favorite bands that Jeremy has managed. Go ahead and go, Mr. Tyler. Uh, the Triple P, the Pumpkin Patch Pythons. Oh, yeah. Awesome yeah. band. Right. That is a four-part accordion harmony that I can't forget. <laughs> okay. I'm glad you didn't take, uh, take the one that I really want. Because I'm going to go with Clans Gender. <laughs> Damn it. God, that's my favorite. <laughs> Derek. Uh, oh, you got no drink. Oh, you yes. Drink. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to go with uh, Dickhead Mike and the Duck Farts. <laughs> <laughs> I was hoping it would come back. It was not. Okay. <laughs> Jeremy, go ahead, buddy. Uh, the Pubic Mice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Did you say Pubic Mice? Mice, yeah. Oh. Fuck. Kind of a hip-hop polka type vibe, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say hip-hop polka? <laughs> There's fucking microphones. Why can't you hear me, you <laughs> jack -up? I was just clarifying. Okay, you got your championship pick, so go ahead. Uh, Reese's Feces. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Uh. Okay, Derek, go ahead. Uh, Jeremy's actually let me in on a few that he's managed that uh, I wasn't aware Keeping of. Keeping secrets. That's fucking cheating. Yeah, uh, so I'm going to go with the Loch Ness Munchers. Oh. <laughs> uh, it's Munters. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. God damn it. How did you get to cheat? That's fucked up. Uh, we, we've had some conversations. Uh, we're today. actually friends. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go with one of Derek's favorites. I'm going to go with the Stinky Twinkies. <laughs> Why are they stinky? You tell me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> now that you know what it's like to be a performer on stage, you know it's kind of hot up here, the lights and shit. <laughs> yeah, that's true. All right, Tyler, you get two back to back. Go ahead. I'm going to go with Sandusky's wish list. <laughs> <laughs> Not my fave, I'll be honest. Uh, <laughs> that was a signing I do regret. <laughs> and still do, because it was a 20-year contract. Holy shit. 
Well, it was 18 year old. Once they get to 18, they're out. <laughs> oh God. Uh, <laughs> All right, you get one oh, more. Go for man. it. Man, and then Uncle Jesse's back watch. Damn it! I won that one. <laughs> Uncle Jesse's back watch is awesome. Steve, they got that behind the bar. That's a well drink, right? <laughs> Get a fifth of Uncle Jesse's backwash? Why not? <laughs> oh, all right. I guess I'll go ahead and take Regis's uterus. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's a steal. The third round. How about you, Derek? Another unknown. Monty and the Pythons. Okay, Monty. <laughs> I hear they're, they're pretty good. Right, Jeremy? Well, they say me. Oh, got it. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all. <laughs> it's their big hit. Yeah, I, at first I was like, this is fucking great. And then it's like, okay, we can fucking get it. <laughs> How about you, Jeremy Joseph? Uh, the pucker pants. Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, and onion lung. Onion what? Onion lung. Onion lung. <laughs> lung. What did they do? They do music, oh. jag off. They're fuck <laughs> they call fucking bingo numbers. What the fuck do you think they do? <laughs> All right, fine. Derek. Uh, yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with that grunge band he grunge band he managed, uh, the hippo dicks. Hippo dicks. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Not as big as you'd think. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, certainly more aggressive. Okay. I'm gonna go with the slutty professors. I like that one. <laughs> mm. That's an old one. Thank you all for icing him. <laughs> <laughs> That, that is a, those, those are two words that I came up with, and I am so glad you shivved him on that. <laughs> Tyler, you get two, buddy. Oh, I'll go with Oprah's Golden Shower. Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> that's a tasty treat. Yes. <laughs> and Dog Breath Bodega. Yes. Oh, man. He's... He's going to beat me, is not hands down. Everybody beats him. Anyway, Everybody does. Anyway. Okay. In fact, just give him your fucking microphone. Okay. And you, you go sit with Shade Boy over here. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> my last pick, um, I'm going to go with the Scrow Tumblers. Was that mine? Yeah. I don't think I fucking came up with that. That sounds made up. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a real fucking band. <laughs> Derek, how about you? Well, I've known Jeremy for a while now, and uh, I remember when he first got it started managing bands, and I remember one of the first bands he managed, I'm going to take this, uh, it was uh, the Christian rock band Guns and Moses. <laughs> <laughs> Were they good? Uh, well, a lot of people don't know this, Moses from the Bible, DDPY. <laughs> <laughs> Dude was in great shape. Handstand push-ups, great core strength. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jeremy, you get your last pick of, for the championship here, buddy. This doesn't seem like it should be the end. Uh, oh, yeah, it does. <laughs> yeah, it sure does. But it's gone, <laughs> <laughs> gone way too fucking long. Uh, moonlight buggery. Moonlight buggery. All right. Yeah. I like That's a I British term for ass fucking for anybody here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Did you have any uh, honorable mentions there, Tyler? Oh, I've got a whole entire list. I saw his list. He wasn't fucking around. He came um, prepared. Dahmer's mannequins. That yeah. was a. Uh, <laughs> you could have won. Are you sure that was me? For that. <laughs> Are you? That rascal. He's such a rascal. <laughs> um, what else you got on there? Fish kebab. Fish I mean, kebab? I've, I've huh? got. Garfield's concubine. Uh -huh. Licorice tits. He hates tits. Mondays. Yeah. Licorice tits are great. That is great. Reptilian bus boys. Yeah. That's my oh, favorite. shit. Damn it. I like the reptilian bus boys. Wait, you should have picked it, you jack off. Shut up. Let him fucking talk. <laughs> He's doing better than you could. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. Uh, Rutabaga Twilight. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes. Yeah. I'm not going to go through this whole list. No, I, I listen to a lot of them. Sorry, dude. You're contractually but obligated. I don't know if you knew <laughs> <laughs> You gotta read everything on your phone, including all of your texts. <laughs> <laughs> Especially the ones that came that. from Scotty at three one six. I swear, Derek. And 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 any sex that you get, Levi, up on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to say thank you very much, Tyler. I sincerely do appreciate the awesome suggestion for the draft. You can go to Facebook.com/slash Laughing on the Sidelines and vote by clicking on the corresponding emoji, and your list, my friend, will be on there. So everybody, thank, thank you to Tyler Cordy. I appreciate it. Fun fact: We picked Tyler's category, 
and then messaged him to see if he was still coming and I hadn't got his previous message and he actually reached out to us and said, we can't make it. I said, we picked you and he said, well, I'm gonna find a fucking way to get there then. Yeah, so he made it. Yeah, as it turns out, Tyler's a fucking liar. Uh, <laughs> he could make it. He just didn't want to. <laughs> Neither did I. Ah. Oh, shit. All right. Well, this uh, gets to my favorite part of every single episode. Keep laughing, asshole. No! Ladies and gentlemen, this is the laughing on the sidelines shitty situation of the week. Oh boy. So Thursday night, me, Derek, Jeremy, and my brother got together. And, uh. Well, yeah. Scotty was via Skype. The rest of us were all in the same house. Oh, funny. Yeah. And, uh, Derek found somewhere to go to find the most disturbing fucking shitty situations I've ever seen in I my life. I think you're life. skipping a fucking part, Scotty. Yeah, Deep in repressed memories. Oh, yeah. That's Who right. is this sponsored I, by I, you, Jack? I'm getting there. No, you're not. Okay, fine. I'll go ahead and do it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the last thing. Laughing on the sidelines. Shitty situation brought to you by Fanger Bang Beer and Legos. Hey, that's right, Scotty. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to talk. I, yeah. yeah. <laughs> as if that was an issue that I couldn't fucking talk whenever I wanted to. Right. Uh, on, uh, on April 11th, uh, 2022, thrill seekers boarded a uh, roller coaster at an amusement park in Berlin, Germany, a city with a very long and beautiful history. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> to help accommodate the uh, large number of uh, patrons, the park chose to do uh, staggered runs, which means that they would start the next one before the last one had actually finished. And uh, for reasons still unknown to this day, uh, the emergency braking system on one of the trains just kicked in, bringing it to a complete stop in the middle of the tracks and uh, forcing the train that was behind it to crash at a very high speed right into it, because, you know, physics. And um, <laughs> this led uh, 31 people to be taken to the hospital, 14 of them very seriously injured, eventually two finally succumbed to their injuries and died from it. And what was the name of this park? Legoland. <laughs> <laughs> that is all. It sure is. I was begging for this. I just I put in uh, people died from Legos. I put that into to Google, just crossing my fucking fingers. And, <laughs> hey, fortune shined on me, not to these people so much, but to me, uh, yeah, it really shined on me. And yeah, people had died from a uh, Lego roller coaster. And uh, now your child can recreate the magic of this moment using nothing but a little imagination and Legos. Legos, why does Berlin get all the good shit? <laughs> So anyways, yeah, we were uh, all sitting around and Derek found this one website and he, t he gave me the option of two to pick from. And I will tell you right now, the one that he selected, I don't like it. Would you rather... That's why we like it. That's yeah. our favorite. This is fucking awful. Would you rather watch your parents fuck every day for the rest of your life or join in one time to make it stop? <laughs> Keep laughing, assholes. <laughs> if that's what it takes to get rid of him, honestly, I'm all for it. <laughs> Do I have to answer this? <laughs> yes, you first. <sighs> this is so... I have to watch my parents fuck forever. You can't join in. What do you do? Cup your dad's balls? Like, you can't stick it no, in No, you have mouth. to finish. Oh, yeah. yeah if you cut yeah, his balls, he can't keep doing it every day for you to watch. That's a short, it's a short, it's a short clip every day. It's, it's, it's just, it's really short, quick, get it done, and then I can go along with my day. I'm never, ever, ever joining in to make it stop. Ever. I'm going with that. Okay. That's Elaborate on that, Scotty. Just no. a little bit. I'd like to hear more uh, about your feelings and watch your parents fuck. No. Go ahead, Derek. Uh, my dad's dead. Yeah. Um, the loophole. And cremated. This so. is a very specific fetish, folks. Yeah. <laughs> and cremated, so my mom will have the ashiest pussy. Mm. Um, 
And I just can't wish that upon anyone. Does uh, oil of Olay take care of that? Yeah. Uh, I don't think so. I think it does. Yeah, it might be in the handbook for the deceased. I don't know. Um, so, I, yeah, I, I just can't wish an ashy pussy on any woman. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, j sure. I'm, I'm just going to have to join in, I guess. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, that's so messed up. Yeah, well, I'm from, I live in Kansas. It's kind of expected. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, everybody's ashy here. Yeah. How do you get <laughs> Go ahead, Jeremy. Oh, is it my turn? It's your turn. Uh, can I defer my pick? Uh, there is a, a young man sitting, I'm going to say, uh, four tables back, five tables back, uh, with a young lady in a, in a white uh, hoodie there. He's, he's, for some reason, it's nice out, but he's wearing a fucking stocking cap. Uh, <laughs> he may or may not be my son. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Brett, what would you prefer? <laughs> I am on the edge Feel of Feel free to just shout it out, head. son, anytime. Stand up. You gonna join in? I think you gotta join in. Yeah! No! You don't do that! What the fuck did I raise? <laughs> God damn! <laughs> You wouldn't want to sit there. He gets under his fucking mother. I'll tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! I thought I raised you better than that. <laughs> you don't want to watch this amazing physique go to town on your mom? Pussy farts for days, Brett. That's. I do have a question. Uh, my question is: Do you think that your mom ever gave your dad a blowjob, and then before you went to bed, she kissed you on the head, like after? <laughs> I can answer that. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I can say with 100% certainty, no, she never did. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. And I don't care for you talking to my son. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this has been probably one of the most fun nights that I've had in a really long time. You know what was really nice about this? I, I, I didn't even think about this at the beginning. We didn't record this at your house, so we didn't have to be so nice to you. The true. This is true. Man. Like, after the fact. I really regret I should have gone mean on you. Yeah, you should have, but you didn't. Appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't. I dropped my fucking knife on the floor, okay? Yeah. <laughs> All over the floor. But, no, but seriously, I'm going to say it, but in all seriousness, oh, Jesus guys, Christ. thank you very much for coming out. We sincerely had a very, very good time putting this together and being able to actually have somebody see us do the show is really fucking cool. Thank you to all the wives that actually sat through and hadn't gotten up a fucking time. God bless you. I sincerely appreciate it. Huh? God bless them. Yeah, bless them. Did you see this fucking train wreck? My God. Uh, but no, thank you guys from the bottom of our hearts. Sincerely do appreciate it. Um, yeah, this is going to be recorded, and so uh, this is going to be really fucking cool to be able to put up on YouTube. Thank you, all of you. Levi, did you record this? Yep. Damn thumbs, it. Thumbs up. <laughs> Damn it. Now we're going to put his... Turns out he forgot to hit the fucking button. Yeah. This is all for none. <laughs> okay, everybody reset. We're going to do this all again from the top. Remember, what, what is it now? Three times we've actually kind of done that? Yeah, yeah. True. We've had to repeat the same stupid fucking jokes over and over again because Scotty forget to hit, forgot to hit the fucking record button. Yeah, that was true. a lot of fun. It was. It well, was at least now fun. you just fuck up the video feed. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Anyways, from all the way from San Diego, from Alabama, St. Louis, to all of you guys that actually came out here, thank you from the bottom of our hearts. We do this because of you, and we sincerely do appreciate it. So if you would do us a favor and tell your friends if you like us, but if you don't like us... Uh, we hope the bartender squirts a bottle of Visine in your drink, and what you thought was a fart wasn't a fart, and you <laughs> diarrhea in your nicest pair of trousers, leading you to never trust a fart again. <laughs> if you don't like us... Tell your enemies. And until next time, guys... Visine, it gets the red out. Until next time... Keep laughing, assholes. Thank you very much. Good night.